So I'm converting this equation. Um, first thing, guys, is let's just understand where this is. Positive, negative, that's somewhere in this fourth quadrant. Now remember, to convert this to polar form, I need to figure out r, and I need to figure out theta. Now, we've got to understand what theta is. Here's r. There's theta in standard form, right? Positive theta, at least. Does that make sense? That's what we've got to figure out. Now, do we have enough information to figure that out? Well, we know these coordinate points. We know this is square root of 2, and this is negative square root of 2. So can I figure out what r is? Sure. r squared equals square root of 2 squared plus negative square root of 2 squared. r is equal to, r squared is equal to 4, r is equal to 2. So now we know the radius is equal to 2, if we're going to graph this in polar form. Um, and now let's go ahead and figure out. Now, we can't figure out theta based on this information, but can we figure out alpha? Yeah, that's just the angle in the triangle. So what relationship would I want to do if I know these two sides to find alpha? Tangent of alpha equals negative square root of 2 over square root of 2. Now, hopefully, when you guys type this into your calculator, you got to understand, like if you type this in your calculator, in degree mode, this is going to give you what? Okay. If you do it in radian mode, if you do it in radian mode, it's going to give you um, it's going to give you a decimal that you probably wouldn't recognize. So it's important for also you guys recognize that this is an angle that you guys know. Hopefully, like you guys should hopefully recognize that what is the what angle gives you negative one for a radian, which is equivalent to pi 45 degrees, pi over four. But again, guys, is this really like from there to there is the negative angle, right? But pi over 4 just represents the measure. Remember, it's only giving you negative 45 degrees because your calculator is restricted. Um, so however, that's what alpha is. What is theta? Alpha is from there to there is negative, is negative 45 or pi over 4. So what is this? Anybody know? Yeah, but do radians. 7 pi over 4. So we can say if this, if alpha is negative pi over 4, so from here to here is pi over 4, then we know theta is 7 pi over 4. So now can we convert this? Sure. Radius is 2. The angle is 7 pi over 4. Is that something we can graph now, too? Is it something we can graph? Yeah. yeah. Just go ahead and draw two radius. And then go to 7 pi over 4, which would be down here. If, you, if I give you um, a graph or something to graph in polar form, I will give you these circles. So you won't need to create them. I made that mistake one time by asking students to create their own circles. <laughs>